Okay. Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm gonna be making something super simple. <laughs> Today I'm gonna be making something super simple. <laughs> I can't do this. <laughs> Today I'm going to be making something very, very special to me. I'm going to be making pizookies. You guys might have noticed all the plants around me. This was not at all my idea. Somebody else decided to grab the plants around my apartment and put them in the kitchen because they want this to be jungle themed. I'm gonna be making pizookies in a jungle themed kitchen. Let me explain to you why this is so special to me. When I first started out this channel, I tweeted, comment a number, between 13 to 248, maybe I'll make the recipe you make. Wait, no. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Wait. <laughs> Wait, again. Comment a number 13 to 248, maybe I'll make the recipe you pick. Now, this cookbook that I use, Chrissy Teigen's cookbook, the recipes are from 13 to 248. And at the time, Elijah was at work when I was making my first video and he saw my tweet and he replied to it saying 243. So, Pazuki's on page 243. And when he said that, it was kind of like crazy to me because our first and second dates were at BJ's and we had Pazuki's there. It was like, wow, what are the odds? <laughs> but another reason why this is like so dear to my heart um, is because during the holidays for christmas me and elijah went to go visit his family in california and while we were there we were just hanging out having a good time and then his family was just asking us questions about our relationship that we've been together for coming on three years now but they were just asking about like how we met and our first dates things like that so we told them that our first date was in Huntington Beach and we hung out there for a little bit and then we went to BJ's and then his mom started like tearing up and she was so shook and it was so cute but turns out his parents after they got married they went on a honeymoon to Huntington Beach and the first place they went to go eat was the same exact BJ's that we went to so I'm really excited to make pizookies because it does like, it does mean a lot to me. Back to making the pizookies, here are the things you'll need. <laughs> Unsalted butter, white sugar, crunchy peanut butter, light brown sugar, kosher salt, baking powder, all-purpose flour, two eggs, vanilla extract, chocolate chips, and peanut butter chips. Step one, preheat the oven to 350. Is that awkward? Should I do it again? Step one, preheat the oven to 350. Much better. <laughs> now that the oven is preheating, I'm gonna go ahead and start mixing my ingredients together. The only problem is that I was supposed to use like one of those electronic mixer things, but I don't own one. So we're gonna do this by hand and see how it goes. First, you'll need two thirds cup of the white sugar. Oh my God. <laughs> Good enough. Then you'll need 3 fourths cup of the brown sugar. Oh no, I have sugar. Oh my god. <laughs> Make sure when you're measuring out the 3 fourths cup of the brown sugar that you pack it in tightly. You'll also need to add in one stick of butter. <laughs> it's so buttery. And now you put in two thirds cup of this crunchy peanut butter. Now that everything's in here, I'm gonna mix until it's creamy. Oh God. <laughs> this butter <laughs> is gonna be the best. <laughs> oh yeah, we're getting somewhere, getting creamy. I 
finally have this looking nice and creamy. So I'm gonna go ahead and put in the vanilla extract and then the eggs one by one. Put in two teaspoons of the vanilla extract. <laughs> and then we'll start with just one egg. Yeah, I'm an expert now. Go ahead and mix this thoroughly. Put in the second egg when you're ready. Once I'm done mixing this, I'm gonna go ahead and grab a second bowl. I'm gonna mix the flour, salt, and baking powder. You'll need a half a teaspoon of this kosher salt. Next, we'll add one and a quarter cups of the flour. One cup. Lastly, we'll need one teaspoon of the baking soda. Go ahead and whisk it. When it's thoroughly mixed, you're gonna put in two thirds cup of the peanut butter chips and two thirds cup of the chocolate chips. This is ready, so now I'm gonna just pour my batter into there and pop it in the oven. Okay, batter's in here. Now we're gonna put it in the oven for 40 to 45 minutes. gonna wait for it to cool off a little bit and then I'm gonna serve it with some ice cream and yeah <laughs> okay now for the moment of truth I am gonna try it <laughs> oh my god <laughs> it goes in so nicely Yay! <laughs> 
ice cream it just goes so well this is so good I think BJ's would be really proud of me all right guys this is how you make Pazuki Chrissy Teigen style I really really recommend making it because it is delicious and you'll end up making enough for 10 to 12 people so if you plan on having guests over for dinner definitely give this a try I hope y'all like this video if you did please give a thumbs up if you haven't subscribed yet, I would really appreciate if you did. Let me know in the comments below what you would like me to make next, and I will see you guys next time. Chef Samia, out. Oh.